Despite millions of garbage bins existing on planet Earth, there are currently no way to determine the type of garbage they contain on a public setting. At least $200 billion are spent annually on waste management in America. Part of this amount is spent by waste management agencies to acquire and maintain garbage trucks, pay staff, collect, partition, and dispose of the collected garbage. Let us introduce Recycle.io, a system that targets the solid waste management and recycling industry. Our system aims at lowering the amount of resources spent by those agencies to partition the collected garbage. We do so by keeping track of the type of garbage inserted into a smart recycling bin and a smart compost bin. Any non-recyclable item added to a recycling bin and any non-organic item added to a smart compost bin will be flagged as a violation viewable on a Recycle.io software. This feature allows relevant authorities to optimize the staff headcount and therefore maximize the revenues. The hardware set we use comprises Raspberry Pi, Grove Pi, an ultrasonic sensor, and a camera module. The cloud technology we use includes Azure IoT Hub, Azure IoT Edge, Azure Container Registry, Azure Blob Storage, Azure Service Bus Queue, Azure Functions, and Microsoft Custom Vision.ai. We will now show you a live demo of our system. We set up our bins by positioning an ultrasonic sensor at the top edge while the camera points at the bottom. These two components, connected to the Raspberry Pi and Grove Pi, are therefore able to collect necessary data from discarded trash. Upon deployment of key modules onto the edge device, each new bin will have its ID, location, and type stored into a SQL database via Azure Functions. We will now demonstrate how violations are handled with both types of bins. We will now add two items into a smart recycling bin. The ultrasonic sensor detects items as they are inserted into the bins, while the camera takes photos of those items for processing at the edge. In other words, the item's image is compared against a trend model deployed on the edge device. As you can see, the only violation in this example was caused by the styrofoam. The smart organic bin is also equipped to handle violations in the same fashion. In this example, the cardboard was the source of the violation. The following is the Recycle.io interface displaying five connected bins in a given location. By hovering over a bin, you will be able to see its type and its location. From the same pop-up, by clicking on the More Detail button, you will be able to see detailed contents of the bin. In this example, for this compost bin, we have about 40% amount of CFL, 20% amount of cardboards, 10% amount of plastic bags, 20% amount of styrofoam, and so on. To view images of the violations, simply click the image URL under View Violations at the bottom of the pop-up. In the future, we plan to enhance the usability of our system by adding the following features. Feel level to get a visual representation of how full a bin is, RFID access so that our bins are only usable by registered members. This feature could also be extended to introduce a Fair Waste Bill Act. Lastly, a dispatch feature would be used so that waste management agencies can send out trucks for garbage collections only when necessary.